Yo, what's good, everybody? Welcome to, uh, you know, like a vlog rant video. Uh, today, I'm not going to be going live. Maybe I'll go live tomorrow, but not today. So do apologize for that for those who are expecting a live stream today. Um, but anyways, what I wanted to talk to you guys about, a couple things here, um, you know, some, some things that I've done recently and um, also just kind of like this weird question I have. But why is it... And here's a weird question. Why is it, again, I ask this question a lot. Why does it trigger people when you share your experience and your likes and it doesn't match theirs? I know people have preferences. There's those people who love iPhones and everything's got to be Apple, Apple this, Apple that. If they made Apple shoes, they would wear it. If they made Apple underwear, they would flaunt it. I get it. You love Apple products. You know what I mean? And at the end of the day, hey, more power to you. If it's the best experience you're getting, then, you know, why would I ever suggest for you to go anywhere else? That's my thought process. You know, if you're a Samsung person, same thing, right? Yes, if there were, if there were Google boxers, I, you know, pixel boxers, I would definitely rock them. But, you know, this pertains to a video that I dropped where I basically shared, you know, um, every pixel device that I'm currently using right now as daily drivers and my, why I feel like it's the best experience for me. And it even says it in the title. Pixel experience is best to me, not best for everyone. So I don't know why some people would feel triggered by that video if I'm just sharing my experiences. There are people today that still don't know what the Google Pixel devices can offer. And so I talk about that in my videos, which is why I made a dedicated Pixel channel. So I'm balancing basically three channels right now. I really haven't done nothing on the vlog, but I'm going to. But um, yeah, there's been posting some small videos on the, on the Pixel channel and, you know, posting what I want to post here on the main channel. I just don't understand why people get so triggered by it, you know? Like, I get it. There's going to be a lot of Pixel content, you know, this week, next week, uh, because everyone's getting their, their, their Pixel Fold. And they're, you know, I'm seeing a lot of positive, uh, you know, uh, reviews about it. I'm seeing a lot of people stating that they're, they're in love with their Pixel Fold, which, you know, it's great. It's great to see, you know. Um, I said on the Pixel channel, I did a quick video about the Pixel Fold, and I said that my expectations weren't high for it. And it wasn't because I felt like it was going to be a bad product. It was because it was Google's first crack at a foldable. And I know that they've been working on it for a couple of years now, and it's finally here. But I wasn't going to put it on a level, like as if they've been making foldable devices for, you know, um, three, four, five years, you know? I was going to put them on that scale. I was going to look at it as in Google's attempt, first attempt on a foldable device and how well it would do. And I'm shocked and surprised to see that it's doing very well. But I'm also very happy to know that it's doing very well because if you're dropping $1,800 for this phone, the experience needs to be really good. And I'm happy that people are reporting back on that. So that's great. But just because, you know, that I'm a fan of Google Pixel devices. I like them. I use them. I don't just use them for YouTube to tell you guys, but even if I stop doing YouTube today, I'm still going after Google Pixel phones. I'm still going after the laptops. I'm going after the tablet right now. Um, I got the watch, you know, I got the buds and I got, you know, Google Home products like, like the original. I still use my OG Google Home smart speaker that looks like an air freshener can. I still use it. It's still great. Uh, Google TV, you know, for like a lot of that stuff I use and I show people like my experiences with it, why I like it, why I feel like it works great. All those things, you know, really is just, is just what, what I share in that video. And, you know, it was never to say that the Pixel experience will beat any other ecosystem out there. No, I'm not comparing the Pixel experience to the Apple experience, to the Samsung experience, to the Moto experience. I'm not doing none of that. So I think just people really need to chill when they want to start throwing things out of their little snarky brains. Just kind of chill, you know? It's not that damn serious. These are just phones. If you don't like it, you don't like it. Uh, but everyone knows I'm not part of the Team Pixel program. They don't send me devices every, you know, every year to review or anything like that. That's So if someone thinks that that's the case, like I'm getting all this stuff from them, I'm not. Every Pixel device I bought out of pocket or it was gifted to me by the community, and that's real. Um, so, yeah, I just kind of wanted to address that. As far as like the Pixel channel and everything like that, why did I decide to go through that? 
Well, I just wanted to make a channel that was just specifically dedicated to the Google Pixels. I've been wanting to do that for so many times. Uh, you know, I've, I've made, I think, a channel like that like twice. But then like, I got heavily focused on my main channel that I totally abandoned it and was like, I felt like it was abandoned beyond salvage. So I just, you know, killed those channels. Uh, but this time I'm sticking through. I'm sticking through with all of it when it comes to uh, to the Pixel channel. So there will be content uploaded daily, whether it's how to do this on your Google Pixel or, you know, what kind of features does the current, you know, Android on the Google Pixel offer. Those types of videos, you know, I'm, I'm going to be dropping those videos uh, daily. If it's not a video, it's going to be a short, but it's one of the two. And that's the plan for it. And as far as the main channel, the main channel is still going to go on. I'm still going to talk about, you know, mobile tech on here and the telecom. You know minus a certain carrier but you know i am going to be talking more about mobile x you know i've been uh, using their services i got visible back on this device right here the pixel 7 that i'm recording with i got all this stuff in the works and um and i'm going to continue to pop out these videos for you guys so hopefully you guys are into them and yeah you know, at the end of the day when i do this on youtube understand this and let me make this very clear i don't do it for the money okay so I'm not out here trying to like make big bank and you know just do it like that. I'm not doing it for fame or anything like that. I do this because if I talk like, if I talk this stuff to my kids, my wife, and everybody else, they would turn a nice pasty look. Um, so I do this for the pure pleasure of it. And um, you know, like I told people, e even if I was you know kicked out of the YouTube Partner Program, even if I, you know, just lost everything that i've built except for my channel and videos i would continue to do this because this is what matters most to me and this is what's fun for me vlogging talking tech all that good stuff so anyways thanks for checking out this long ass video smash the like button if you guys enjoyed it um you know what uh hash, hashtag not triggered if you made it all the way to the end and i will talk to you on the next one then yeah it's always aloha